Hey guys, it's VTP. So, this is um something I want to do that's different. I've been watching Vintage Kohler's recent videos, and I noticed the differences in the um ups and downs of bullets and siphon jet toilets, and how they're different from each other. And for this video, I want to give you guys a demonstration of the um bullet toilets and siphon jet toilets myself. Okay, so let me write something y'all know. Okay. So, first of all, I wanted to go over the Vermont. The Vermont is a blow-up bowl, and as you see here, um, it goes in and then up the trapway, and then it just goes from there. From right there, to the siphon jet. And notice that this is higher than the trapway itself, so it can't siphon. Moving on. This is the Mulford, which is a siphon jet. And this one, notice how the tunnel opening in the trapway is extremely large. And notice how when the tunnel goes up, notice how it gets smaller. Because you know why it gets smaller? So, um, because of how big this opening is, it, um, um, it takes, um, it makes the water flow down, and then it makes the trapway, um, create a siphon, so it fills up. So instead of it filling up from just right here, it mainly fills up around this area. And of course, you got two siphon jets, so that, um, adds on. Moving on. This is the Wolford, which is, um, a blowout floor mount bowl, and he goes in, and then it just goes straight down. And then there's two siphon jets right there. Blow up bowl. Ugh. This would have been 1930s to present. Moving on. This is the Volton. And it's like the Volford. The only thing I changed was um the um ten and the third. This one is like the Volford. Except this one is the Copperhead model. So this one would have been introduced in like the 70s or the 80s. This was made. So, um, the Volford is, um, it's basically the same thing as the, um, of the Volton, because it just goes up and then it goes straight down. And this right here is the Hillford. This is the siphon jet floor mount, because when it goes up, it goes through these bends, and as you notice, it gets smaller, so the water can fill up more faster, and then it goes down in there. And then just goes out. Okay, and this one has siphon jets. I'm also there's also a comfort height siphon jet toilet, which is called the Air Danny, but I haven't made that yet, and don't mind that. That wasn't that was a screwed up one. The Air Danny actually has a visible siphon jet, you know, like the Cadet on um, flushometer or Wellworth or something. That's the kind of something Air Danny would have. Yes, that's also comfort heights. That's all I have to say for now, so this is VTP signing off.